Oh! 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 No way! What's up, y'all? We're back with another reaction. Today, we're reacting to MT Pop. He's one of my favorite dancers, I swear. MT Pop is a popper from Vietnam. He used a lot of other techniques in his dance as well, such as tutting, animation, waving, whole bunch of things. We're gonna start off. Sorry. <coughs> We're gonna start off with one of his rounds from top four at RF Jam for the All Style 3v3 category. Are you guys ready? Yeah! Yo. I said you guys ready! Ah! Let's go! Oh, oh, that salsa. Hey. It's got the feel of the yeah. song. Yeah. Oh, it's just straight into it. Sick. Oh! Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> this fit? Dude. It's Dude, like he's got so much like groove while he does it. Legit. Mm. And his control on his toes is really crazy. Like, whoa! Ooh. And he keeps he keeps the feel of the song. His musicality is crazy. Even though what he's doing is like, it's technically very difficult. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like lots of little lots of little isolations, which yeah. you can tend to stiffen up with. But he's still so groovy and relaxed yeah. with it. Oh, oh, I love that he keeps taking those breaks. Just like, oh, yeah, I'm with this song. Yeah, he's in the pocket. Yeah, hey. he makes it look so effortless, but the moves take so much effort, actually. <laughs> oh, dude, he's like mixing like boogaloo legwork with like that kind of Latin feel. It's so nice. Mm. So, so fresh, fresh, man. So it's like good vibing. If Empty Pop were to watch this, what would you say to him? And speak in Vietnamese. <laughs> Amanda! <laughs> Can you translate? I'd say, MT Pop, you are a huge inspiration to my dance, and I love what you do. Em thương an. Samurai. That's it. I feel like she cut out a lot of that. I said he loves MT Pop, that's it. It's true. This next round, as soon as we said MT Pop, my mind immediately went back to this round. So for the Jack of All Trades battle, they basically have to dance with different concepts that will inspire the way they dance. And so for this specific round, so they have to dance like some sort of creature. Like a lion. <laughs> We're about to find out You're what about it to is. Find out. These guys haven't watched this before, no, so I'm no, excited. No, no, no. All right, so here we go. He starts off like super slow to get into character. Why is it so like enticing though? You want to watch it. And look oh. at his foot control to get the different like... What the heck? Shapes. Dude. He's got so much body control. Oh! oh. oh. He's leaking! <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy! He, I don't know when he drank That's the so water. Cool. I don't know when he drank He's it. He's had it in his mouth for 30 minutes. He just drooled on the stage. But it's his control and he's like, oh! Yeah. The ding with the music. A little foot wave there. Ooh. They're just so intricate. All these details. But also his shapes are really like rounded and interesting at the same time. Yeah. Like see, he's got mm. that crump and lurch in there. Yeah. Ah. <sighs> Again, like he... And the... He, yeah. The facials, like he's really getting into the character. I feel like he takes it a bit from like animation, where character is like super, super important. Yeah, yeah. Because he uses a lot of animation and tiny technique in his dance. Right. Oh! I was... No! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> tongue isolation. Not the tongue isolation, bro! No. How do you dude, think of no this? Just so that he did a fixed point isolation with his tongue. How do you think of this? Oh! So creative. I was gonna say it's so effortless for him as well. Yeah. He's just creating on the fly. He's not worried about what he's doing. It's yeah. like I feel like that's the level, like when that the level that's the level he's at. Where it's like you can just create. You're just free. Look at him. Uh, <laughs> oh. Dude. What a crazy round. That was, in, that was insane. Yeah. So this last one, this is the Bionic Boogie 7 to Smoke at RF Jam. So, how the Bionic Boogie worked... So they pretty much chose people who made it far in the prelims too. I'm gonna be real, I don't know what you mean. No. <laughs> I feel like you just said words and none of them... So, yeah. wait here. So this is basically like the best of the best out of all the popping categories yeah, exactly. from the event. This is a 7 to Smoke. If you want to know how 7 to Smoke works, you can check out our own video where we did a 7 to Smoke between no all the Pokemon members. Yes, way, you were yes there. Yes, way, I was there. You were there and you I battled. I was in it. And you were in it as well. What? 7 to Smoke video. Check it out if you want to see a bit of our dancing and see how 7 to Smoke works. But right now we're going to watch MT Pops. Mm. 
The King Tuts, bro. Ooh. Yeah. I've noticed that, like, no matter he he changes it up based on the um, song so much, like he doesn't have one way of moving. Oh, absolutely. Oh. <laughs> We're all just. Saying... Dude, oh. I swear I say it every oh time, but his gosh. foot control is crazy. And I love his tuts. I love his tuts so much. <sighs> He's real patient with it. Yeah. Shit. That's what I noticed as well. Like, the music, his sets always seem long to me because I feel like he's so patient with the music. Like, he's not rushing at all. Mm. But at the same time, he's fitting, like, even though he's patient, he's fitting so much variety in his Yeah. Sets. Mm. Dude! <laughs> no crazy. way! His technique is solid, but then he's got also got the flavor. He's got yeah. the character. Yeah. He makes you feel something when he dances, but all his technique is so solid. He knows like, his stuff. Um, empty, um, empty, empty pop. pop. Empty pop. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Bye. See ya. Help! <laughs>